Right, so we're in the right position. Okay, off we go. Right, so where were we? Hmm. Yeah, so I'm just doing the bit on the top of his head and his ear now. Um, so I've just gone over it with the lilac and then over it with the dark, kind of really dark gorgeous blue. There we are. You can see that. And then um, over with the black. Now I want to use a, a harder stick for the black now because they need to be very... Um, see, I'm going to use this stick here, the Faber-Castell, because it needs to be nice and hard because we're going to do some thin lines through there. And we'll just let me get a bit more, bit more lilac on there as well. Let me just put that over a bit there while we're doing this. See, I can see there's a lot, that these are a lot brighter here. So I'm just gonna kind of go over this a bit. These are the bits, the little bits and pieces that give it that lovely bitty look and show how shaggy the hair is. Just tap it back. That's a bit blurrier there, so it doesn't need to be as defined. This kind of, that's all right there. That's okay. This is quite dark. That's a little bit more subdued in the middle. This is coming out like that, really. That's it. This is a bit more subdued in there. Okay, so we've got some lines coming through. Just get the white ready and some some of the Caran d'Ache white because it's really lovely and strong. You know, we, we just used it on there earlier. So let's try. Let's try this. Let's see, now taking an oversight, we've got a, still got a lot of black through there. Now I can see those little hairs close up, but I'm going to go over them because 
it's much blacker through there and it's making a nice curve and that curve is going round like that right through all of those hairs there and then we've got another line kind of going through there as well let's go this kind of direction much more subdued so just tuck it back and then you can hardly see this you really can hardly see that so go over it again in black make it really dark you've just got that little brightness there on the end This is making much more of a, a point there. You see it's going into a quite a point there. It's just a case of making sure that the black is really black again and picking all out or picking all those bits out again to give it that three-dimensional look Some nice black curls there, well, hairs rather, and nice and flicky coming through there. to be coming up here. I can hardly see that bit there on the end. It's quite a thick bit there. Huh? a little bit higher there. That's it. And then we've got some greys in here. So we'll get those in with the lilac just through here. It's coming 
more oppressed by that style. Now, let's have a look at this. Right. We need some lightness in there. And knock it back. Just give it another dimension there and we we'll need some oh yes this one this this other one here we'll put this in the background here These, they need to be a bit more lilac y in here. Um, that's at least some black through it. That's too thick. I think what we need to do is get this angle here a bit more rounded, a bit more coming out like that and down like that. But then that goes into the bit there. It's also merging into this here. That's quite straight. gives it a nice three-dimensional look. Then we'll use some of the white now to see how that goes. Very light touches. We'll just lift it a little bit here and there. a little light here and there. It's quite light on the end this little bit. And that's flipping around. That's yeah, that's quite light in there. We need to get some black in there first. This is quite light. I need to put some black in here, just a little bit here.
some orange in here, I think. Just brighten that up a bit there. And then go over it with the, with the um, orange red. Okay, now let's put those down. Just look at these, these three here. Now we've got a little bit of something there which is quite nice and light. And then we're getting a good bit of light there. So these are very white in here, nice and light on my picture. Got to be careful, don't overdo these. Don't do too many, and then it will really be effective. And you can see there's little bits of hairs going in all directions there. Just definitely put those in. This is a bit darker now. Step back. You can see this is this needs to be darkened up a bit. Just go over it with the with the back. Let them show through. Just go over it with the back. And here, it's a little bit. Just, just, just streaks through it.
these up, sorry, lighten these up a bit. They're a bit more, they're a bit paler, so they'll show up a bit more. Tap it back. It's actually a bit of green in there. straight into his eye. But what I want to do is make sure that this is really right here. And I think it's a little bit slim, so I'll just thicken it up a bit. Just a little bit of brightness in there. And here. These little things make a massive difference. Really need to get these in. And then that bit in the middle is a bit more blue. So, and it's the really darker blue here. 